Hello, and welcome to this Boiler Key video tutorial. Our goal is to set you up with the two-factor authentication system in order to keep all of your private information secure. Let's get started. Open your internet browser and type in the URL www.purdue.edu slash boilerkey. Then type in your career account and password. On the next screen, click the top link to set up a new dual mobile boiler key. Step 1. Download the dual mobile application. This application can be utilized on multiple makes of smartphones. On an iPhone, launch the App Store. Then search for Duo Mobile. Tap the Free button and then click Install to download and install the application to your phone. Once the app has been installed, click Open. A prompt will appear. Click Allow to send you notifications. On an Android device, launch the Google Play Store. Then search for Duo Mobile. Tap the Install button to download and install the application to your phone. Once the app has been installed, click Open. Click Continue to go to the next step. Step 2. You will enter a four-digit boiler key PIN. In order to be more secure, this number should not be your ATM PIN or something as simple as 1234. Once you have entered and verified your PIN, click Continue to go to the next step. Step 3. Name your device on the desktop computer. If you have multiple devices, this will help to distinguish between them. An example name would be iPhone or iPhone 6. Click Continue to move to the next step. Step 4. Capture QR code. Open the dual mobile application on your smartphone. Once opened, you will see Add Account or a plus symbol in the top right corner. Choose either of those and using the smartphone's camera, capture the QR code shown on the desktop computer's screen. A button will appear on your phone's screen. Click the button to confirm. Click Continue to move to the next step. Step 5. Test the boiler key. On your computer, enter your username and next to password, use your four-digit PIN number followed by comma P-U-S-H. After entering PIN comma push, a notification will appear on your phone that will require your action to either approve or deny. Step 6. Set up self-recovery. Once you finish setting up your boiler key, you should also complete the self-recovery setup. Self-recovery allows you to set up a new device should you lose or replace the old one. To do this, click Enable Boiler Key Self-Recovery, then enter your cell phone number, a code will be texted to your phone. Confirm your number by using that code that was texted to you. Now that your boiler key is set up, you will be required to use it on the One Purdue employee portal. This completes the setup of your boiler key application. For more information, visit purdue.edu slash boiler key or gold answers.